Welcome to the Transitions Daily Podcast. Transitions Daily is an online recovery group that offers a daily distribution of popular recovery resources accompanied by a secret Facebook group for discussion. We hope you enjoy today's readings. This is Transitions Daily for December the 17th, read by Kirsty S. from the East Midlands in the United Kingdom. AA thoughts for the day. Meetings. Through going to meetings and listening, and occasionally speaking, through doing 12-step work, whereby in helping others you are both the teacher and the student, by making many wonderful AA friends, I have been taught all the things in life that are worth living. Alcoholics Anonymous, 3rd edition, page 416. Thought to consider. Meetings. A check-up from the neck-up. Acronyms. Willing. When I live life, I need God. Just for today, expansion from a vision for you. Every few days, this doctor suggests our approach to one of his patients. Understanding our work, he can do this with an eye to selecting those who are willing and able to recover on a spiritual basis. Many of us, former patients, go there to help. Then, in this eastern city, there are informal meetings such as we have described to you, where you may now see scores of members. There are the same fast friendships there is the same helpfulness to one another. Alcoholics Anonymous, page 163. Daily Reflections, a priceless reward. Work with other alcoholics. It works when other activities fail. Alcoholics Anonymous, page 89. Life will take on a new meaning, as the big book says, page 89. This promise has helped me to avoid self-seeking and self-pity. To watch others grow in this wonderful programme, To see them improve the quality of their lives is a priceless reward for my effort to help others. Self-examination is yet another reward for an ongoing recovery, as are serenity, peace and contentment. The energy derived from seeing others on a successful path of sharing with them the joys of the journey gives to my life a new meaning. As Bill sees it, random quote, the value of human will. Many newcomers, having experienced little but constant deflation, feel a growing conviction that human will is of no value whatever. They have become persuaded, sometimes rightly so, that many problems besides alcohol will not yield to a headlong assault powered only by the individual's will. However, there are certain things which the individual alone can do. All by himself and in the light of his own circumstances, he needs to develop the quality of willingness When he acquires willingness, he is the only one who can then make the decision to exert himself along spiritual lines. Trying to do this is actually an act of his own will. It is a right use of this faculty. Indeed, all of AA's 12 steps require our sustained and personal exertion to conform to their principles, and so we trust to God's will. 12 and 12, page 40. Big book quote. If there be divorce or separation... There should be no undue haste for the couple to get together. The man should be sure of his recovery. The wife should fully understand his new way of life. If their old relationship is to be resumed, it must be on a better basis, since the former did not work. This means a new attitude and spirit all round. Sometimes it is to the best interests of all concerned that a couple remain apart. Obviously, no rule can be laid down. Let the alcoholic continue his programme day by day. When the time for living together has come, it will be apparent to both parties. Alcoholics Anonymous, 4th edition, Working with Others, page 99. 24 hours a day. AA thought for the day. The way of faith is, of course, not confined to AA. It is for everybody who really wants to live. But many people can go through life without much of it. Many are doing so to their own sorrow. The world is full of lack of faith. Many people have lost confidence in any meaning in the universe. Many are wondering if it has any meaning at all. Many are at loose ends. Life has no goal for many. There are strangers in the land. They are not at home. But for us in AA, the way of faith is the way of life. We have proved by our past lives that we could not live without it. Do I think I could live happily without faith? Meditation for the day. 
He maketh his sun to rise on the evil and the good, and sends the rain on the just and the unjust. God does not interfere with the working of natural laws. The laws of nature are unchangeable, otherwise we could not depend on them. As far as natural laws are concerned, God makes no distinction between good and bad people. Sickness or death may strike anywhere, but spiritual laws are also made to be obeyed. Our choice of good or evil depends on whether we go upward to true success and victory in life or downward to loss and defeat. Prayer for the day. I pray that I may choose today the way of the spiritual life. I pray that I may live today with faith and hope and love. Hazelden Foundation, PO Box 176, Centre City, MN 55012. My name is Kirsty and I'm an alcoholic. We hope you enjoy today's readings. You can also receive Transitions Daily via email and discuss today's readings in our secret Facebook group. So for more information, go to dailyaaemails.com today. Other than the 24 hours a day reading, unless otherwise specified, all quotes copyright Alcoholics Anonymous World Services, Inc., 1952 through 2001.